Hello everyone, this is Minji Chen. I'm an assistant professor of electrical engineering at Princeton University, and I lead the Princeton Power Electronics Research Group. In our group, we build circuit and systems to manage electricity. Power electronics can be found in all kinds of electronic systems. We build inverters for solar panels. We build motor drives and battery management systems for electric vehicles. We build actuators and power management architectures for robotics. And we build wireless power transfer systems for biomedical applications. If I use one sentence to summarize what we do in our group, we build smarter, smaller, and more efficient powertronics for emerging and important applications. We want to make powertronics smarter so that it can play more sophisticated functions in the future systems. We want powertronics to be smaller so that our cell phones and robotics can be more powerful and smaller. We want my powertronics to be more efficient so that we can, number one, save energy, and number two, make the batteries last for a longer time. One example application that we're currently looking at is topologies for efficiency and power density. We're currently work working with Google and Intel to develop next generation powertronics for their TPUs and GPUs. The next generation TPU will need the power electronics for, to convert voltage from 48 volt to 1.8 volts and deliver 250 amps of current. We're targeting an efficiency of 95% and a power density of 100 watt per centimeter square. So in order able to achieve all of these goals, we need innovations from devices, circuits, topologies, architectures, and packaging. Hopefully, this design will be used in the next generation of Google TPUs. We're also very interested in looking at novel architecture for sophisticated energy systems. The future solar panels, uh, data centers, and energy storage systems are all sophisticated energy systems that has thousands of modular building blocks. So how can we rethink the power delivery architecture in these systems and make the system more efficient, more reliable, and can perform more sophisticated functions is our goal. One of the systems that we're building is we are converting the conventional uh, parallel architecture in existing data centers into a serious stack architecture, which allow us to improve efficiency from about 90% to 99.5%. So that's our goal. And hopefully, this kind of architecture will become the normal new standards for the future data centers and make our computing infrastructure more cleaner, cleaner and more sustainable. Finally, we are also very interested in developing this power FPGA concept. Essentially, we want to build flexible, programmable, granular, and adaptive powertronics. We'll explore all of these fundamental building blocks and try to think about a way how can we put all of these, these building blocks into a software programmable power conversion architecture that can benefit a wide range of applications. One example design that we're currently working on is a smart inverter that can self-organize itself into microgrids such that we can make the future grid more reliable and more robust. In terms of group cultures, we define ourselves as powertronics artists. We think, we invent, and we build. If you like the process of converting theory into real-world hardware implementation, if you like circuits and systems, if you are excited about energy-related applications, Welcome to Princeton Power Electronics Research Group.